Good evening. Welcome, everyone. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. I hope everything is okay with you, yes? Yes, teacher. Okay. I'm happy for that. And here we go, okay? In a couple of seconds, we are going to get started with um, our class number 19, yeah? And I am glad that almost all of you are over with only two students are pendant with the activities okay, in the platform. It is exactly the time to get started class. So here we go. Good evening and welcome Eliel, Alexis, welcome. Pablo Adalberto, welcome. As I told you, I am so glad that all of you are here. Let's expect that your other partners are going to join. Uh, later but meanwhile i'm going to start sharing my screen with you okay here i'm going to share my ppt with you class teacher buenas noches hello mire eh, voy a estar llegando un ratito que acabo de llegar a la casa y tengo que cocinar ahorita okay thank you for joining but keep connected okay, okay. Okay. Sí, sí, sí. Okay, thank you. Okay, class, here we go. Uh, today is May 30th, 2023, and we continue, okay? And we have, as I told you, that today is the penultimate class, and it is our video conference number 19. As every day, activity number one, greetings, what I did at the beginning, we are going to have a feedback or review on what we did in the previous class yesterday. In this case, one of you is going to help me reading the objectives. In the pre-task, we have to identify polite and impolite sentences. You are going to make polite requests as the preparation task, and you're going to listen to a specific request. And at the end, the wrapping up of the class as every single day that we have been meeting here for this class. So, as I told you, I need one of you to help me reading the objectives. Who is going to help me reading the objectives today? Okay, Alexis, I appreciate your participation. Please go ahead. Okay, teacher. A specific objective. Participant will be able to make information request. Class objective. Participant will be able to use can for informal request. Excellent. Request. Excellent. Very well. So class, the class objective for today is that all of you as participants are going to you to be using can for informal requests. If you remember yesterday we were using could for formal requests. Today is can for informal requests, okay? That is the big deal for today. And then we continue. The homeworks and evaluations, let me see if it is in here. Uh, hello, Jocelyn, Fanny, uh, Tulio, Francisco Ernesto, Sochil, and Sarita, welcome. Okay. The person that I needed to address for this situation is absent at the moment. But congratulations for all the people who are right now in the class because you are over with the homeworks and evaluations. Okay, great. And uh, you are done with all your works in the platform, the people who are here in this meeting right now. So I have nothing to tell you about this and we'll skip it. And we go over the next one, the, the next slide, the requirements. I'm going to ask maybe Sarita, would you like to help me reading the requirements? Okay. Requerimientos. Nombre completo al conectarse a la plataforma. En el caso de oyentes, agregar palabra oyente luego de su nombre. Cámara encendida durante toda la sesión. 
minimizar el sonido ambiente lo más posible. Participación activa. Great, thank you. Now we move to the other slide. Just a reminder. Remember, attendance 100% of the class is the objective. It was the goal for the course. And that you need to meet 120 minutes in each class in order to generate the effective attendance in each session every day. And also as a reminder that attendance is taken twice, at least at 8.20 and at 9.40. And remember that the attendance is going to be taken as valid when we listen to you as participants say, Presente, here, here I am, and your camera must be on. Also, the sessions one-on-one -on -one at the end of the class is ready for each of you. Ten minutes, okay? And remember, I am not allowed, I don't have the authorization to give anybody permission to be absent in class, okay? If a problem, you write it and the administration is going to take notes in order to report it to INSA4. Okay, here we have in Zoom, this is the expectation. Everybody with the cameras on. The mute or silence button available. If you are not participating, microphone off. Camera on, the two chats are available via WhatsApp and via Zoom. The breakout rooms are available because we need to interact okay, in small groups. And when you are in the breakout rooms, the ask for help button is available for you in case that you need me to help you in any situation. Okay, And congratulations because you have been respecting one another every day that we have been meeting in class. Thank you so much for that. And here, tomorrow, May 31st, is our last day of class. And uh, today is the series, okay? That's why I was congratulating the people who were here because you are done, you are over. You finish your activities in the platform, okay? The ones who were here, okay? And now we have this conversation. If you remember class, okay? Um, Yesterday, we were practicing this conversation, so I need um, two participants to help me reading as uh, the first part of the feedback, okay? I need two volunteers. I. Okay, Sarita I and Pablo. Okay, Sarita, you are going to read Max, and Pablo, you read Joe. Okay, let's begin. Okay, Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work with Tip Tip.com. We designed the new printer, and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joy. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on second, please? So oh, it is a uh, OC page in <clears throat> X. Sorry. Okay. First, make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right. It is. Could you tell me what I need to need to next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the train. And third, on the menu, menu uh, appears on the screen. Click on complete is instant. Okay, thank you. Only mm -hmm, over here. Okay, first make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All oh, right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once 
once, okay? Once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. This is the conversation you practiced yesterday. You switch roles in the breakout rooms and you created at the end one conversation and you presented it yesterday um, as the golden touch at the end of the class, if you remember. But also you were discussing these two questions. Do you ever make requests? If so, what kind of requests do you make? Yeah. And here is what I was telling you. Could. Could is the modal auxiliary that we use in order to ask for something to somebody in any place, especially at work, in a very nice way, in a friendly way, in a polite way, yeah? We use could. So um, right now, let me see over here. Um, okay. let me check, and uh, where is it, here, yeah, I'm going to share it with you. So you can go to the breakout rooms and you can practice it because I need you to practice as much as possible. Okay. Good evening. Over here. Let me see. I'm going to share it with you, class. Yes, this is your group. Okay. Mm, let me see. Ah, Francisco, you were here. You were absent yesterday because of the problems with the connectivity, but now everything is okay, yes? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so you're going to have the chance to practice today with um, with the conversation, okay, in the breakout rooms. And here we go. Josue. I need you to work in the in the in the platform. Okay? Because tomorrow is the last day of classes. And then remember you need at least the 80% and the final test has a, a percentage, a very high percentage. If you don't take the final test, you might fail the course, okay? So I need okay. you to do everything. Section one, two, three, four, and the final test and the midterm test. Everything must be done. Okay, so class, right now I'm going to transfer you. Hello, Teresa. Welcome, Fanny, Francisco Ernesto Gonzalez, and the others. Okay, but okay, I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms so you can practice the conversation. And here we go. Okay. The conversation that I have shared with you via WhatsApp, the one that was the highlight yesterday is the feedback right now, okay? I'm going to open all the breakout rooms. Join your groups, please. I sent you the invitation. Join your groups. Go to your groups. Thank you. Carita, Teresa de Jesús, Julio, Eliel, Fátima, join your groups. Oscar, join your groups, please. So you can have the practice.
Hola. Hello, hello. Hola. Hello. Miss. Hello, teacher. Yes, Francisco. Eh, sorry, voy entrando, no me puede ilustrarlo. You have the instructions here in number two. Uh, this is what we practiced yesterday. So you are going to practice the conversation as a feedback. Solo van a practicar la conversación como repaso porque ayer practicamos y desarrollamos todo lo que está acá. Entonces, como okay. repaso, solo vamos a, a practicar la conversación. Ok, tenemos a Francisco y a Sarita porque las otras dos personas están como ausentes, ¿verdad? Porque están como oyentes. Okay. Yo en el camino, dice, en cinco minutos uh -huh. en casa. Ah, ok, entonces luego ya pueden integrar acá, pero les avisan a ellos, ok, para que puedan practicar. Entonces, Francisco y Sarita pueden sí, comenzar sí. a practicar en lo que los otros compañeros eh, ya están disponibles. ¿De acuerdo? Okay. De acuerdo. Sí, 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 sí. Remember, remember to switch roles, ¿ok? Recuerden okay. que cambiar roles. Ok. Vaya, bueno, Francisco, empiece. I need help. Could you help me, please? No problem. Yo... Could you tell me to could you tell the mother? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, X forty pay max thirty. Okay, great. Make sure that the power core is to get in. All right. It is called you tell me what I need to do next, please. Second. Check that the interaction to be in the device and third one is menu icon on the screen. Click on complete the task. Acuerdo? Okay. Okay, okay Pablo. Bye, chica. Okay, inicio. Vale. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Yao. Hello, ya vine. Oh, ah, ok, entonces dejamos que participe Fátima. Terminemos ahorita nosotros, Pablo, el inicio de los dos, ¿verdad? Y después incluimos a Fátima. Ok, perfecto. Ok. Eh, iniciamos otra vez. Ok, hello, this is Max from Tech Support. ¿Cómo can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Yao. I work for tape.com. We will say the new printer and I need help setting. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it is. A ulti face in a very. Okay. First, make the sure that the power core is plugged in. All right. It is called to tell me what I did to the next please. Second, check that the installation CD in this tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click or complete install. Okay, ahora cambiamos. Okay. Hello, this is man from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hey, Max. My name is Joe. I work for peps.com. We reside in new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Uh, it's a ulti page MX30. Fanny, are you available to practice? Fanny, está disponible. No, teacher, I'm working. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, Josué, hello, Josué.
Uh, entonces la voy a transferir a usted, Erika. Erika. Ok, mis. Para que pueda practicar. ¿Está disponible para practicar, Josué? Sí. Vaya, entonces Erika practica con él. Es la conversación que les compartí vía WhatsApp, ¿de acuerdo? Como feedback. Ok. Ok. okay. Solo quiero ver la imagen. Es la conversación que practicamos ayer. Un, de, de, soporte técnico. Yes. Ok. Could you, could you. Ah, pues, inicio. Uh -huh. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joy. I work for Pips.com. We receive the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Who is an Ultipage MX thirty? Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right. It is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the install installation CD is in the tray and there once the me me menu appears on the screen click on complete install okay ahora intercambio hello okay. this is max front tech, tech support how can i help you hi max my name is joe I work for pips.com. We receive the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joel. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you have, pardon, can you hold on a second break? Oh, it is out the case in X study. Okay, first, make sure that the power core is plugged in. All right, it is. Call you tell me what I need to the next place. Second, check that the inst Installation CD is the tray and third once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. Okay, invertimos papeles. Okay. Hello, this is Max from Tech Super. How can I help you? Hi Max, my name is Joe. I work for peps.com. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem. Joe, could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's an um, ulti page, ulti page MX30. Okay. Please make sure that the power core is clean. All right, it is. Could you tell me what, what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD in the try. And first, once the menu offers on the screen, click on complete start. Okay. Allá, hoy te tengo que tocar con Francisco. Ok.
Inicio. Ok. Ok. Hello, this is man from test. Uh, perdón, hello, this is Matt from test support. What can I help you? I help you. Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for peps.com. We reside the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's an employed MX30. Okay, please. Make sure the, the power core is played in. All right, it is all you tell me what I what I need to Teacher José, ya, ya lo practicamos. Ah, Teresa. Pero los dinosaurios no pueden. Ya, yeah, yes, that is what I was, uh, because Teresa de Jesús is here, but now I am reading, she has already got back. Ella acaba de regresar porque tenía problemas de conexión, pero está como oyente, no puede practicar, Teresa. No, no puede practicar. Bien, entonces... Creo que retornaremos al salón principal, ¿de acuerdo? Thank okay, you for your practice. Okay, let's get back. Now that all of you are back, I'm going to call your names in order to take your, your attendance. Yeah, because I don't see here. Okay, let me see. Here we go. Uh, Brandon Alexis. Here I am, teacher. Okay, thank you. Cecilia, Cecilia Unice, she's absent today. Raniel Eduardo is absent. Diana, Diana is absent at the moment. And uh, Erika. Blessing, Miss. Thank you. Fanny. Fanny. Thank you, Fanny. Thank you, Fanny. Fatima. Miss Fatima here. Fatima. Miss Fatima, hello. Francisco. I'm here, teacher. El teacher se me traba por otro. Okay. Francisco Antonio Correa Sineve. Yes, today. Hello. Yes. Okay. Francisco Ernesto González, today yes, you are yes. here. Uh -huh. Today, yes. Jocelyn. Present, teacher. Amy okay, Jocelyn, thank you. Eliel. Los de Connectivity. Okay. Francisco Mejía. Eh, 
Francisco Ernesto González, Francisco Inede, Bachet Day, Francisco Mejía, is not here. Josué. Present. Mm -hmm. Luis is absent. Mayra. Absent. Oscar. Present teacher. Okay, you are here. I thought you had lost the connectivity, but you are here. Pablo. I am here, teacher. Great. Sarita. Present, Miss. Thank you. Tania. Present, teacher. Okay. Teresa. Present. Okay, Teresa. Sochil. Hi, Miss. Present. Hi, thank you. Tulio. Present, present. Thank you, Tulio. Okay. Now, class, you have practiced the conversation using polite requests, but um, the polite requests that are formal. Yes? If I say, Sarita, could you lend me a pencil? Could you lend me a pencil? What could be the answer? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, very well. Or yes, of course, right? Or immediately, or here you are. Remember, usually when uh, somebody asks a request in a polite way, the answer is affirmative, okay? Remember that. Now we go over. Let me see. We have here and here. Okay, not this one. Better this one, the full one. This is what you have been practicing. Okay, it's loading. Now you can see. This is the conversation you were practicing and notice that the modal auxiliary is could. Could you help me please? Could you tell me the model? And we have, could you tell me what I need to do next, please? But here you have one sentence using can. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's an multi page, okay? This is the kind of structure we're going to be practicing today. But right now, mm -hmm. as part of the feedback, you are going to be transferred again to the breakout rooms and you are going to write 10 formal requests using could. You are going to choose one class partner to share the sentences in the main session room. In other words, you work as a group and you write as a group. You create 10 sentences, but request sentences using the modal auxiliary could and the word please. Remember that always we need the question mark at the end. When you finish writing the sentences, you select one classmate who is going to read the sentences here in the main session room, or you may choose two partners. One is going to read five, and the other one is going to read five. Is that okay? Did we get it? Okay. Okay. Do you want me to share this slide? Or that's okay. ¿Quieren que les comparta esta diapositiva con las instrucciones o así está claro? Yes, we are. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to share it with you. Right now. This one.
Okay, there you are. Now I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms. Yes, here we go. You need to produce the language right now, okay? Everybody participating, please. Eliel, do you remember your partners? ¿Te recuerda el nombre de los compañeros, Eliel? Uh, creo que eran José Isaac y Fanny. Fanny. Okay. I sent you the invitation, Eliel. You are Eliel with Erica, Fanny, Josue. Okay. Go to your groups, please. Join your groups. Hello. Hello. Okay. Hold it. Okay, here you are, Sarita, Francisco. I don't know if Oscar is going to be able to practice, and Tania is here, okay? Begin okay. building the 10 polite requests. Comiencen a escribir las 10 polite requests. Mm, que ah, si son las de ayer tengo varias también. Ajá. Yo Para que las la... Ok. Bueno, ah, pues escribo, la... entonces, ahí en el chat. Ya la escribo, pero no sé. Very well, Pablo. Solo que es ten, chicas. Ahí se me fue una E. En, me faltó una N. Ok. okay. It's good okay. that you sí, identify the mistakes. Ok, excellent.
With the sports, check out the spelling of the word sport. With, with. Revisen la, la escritura de with, el orden. ¿Cómo se escribe entonces, Miss? With W I T H. Mm -hmm. Yes, correct. And I think the TH were mixed. Is everything okay here, Erika and Josue? And yes, Alexis, teacher. Alexis is also participating. Excellent. Yes, uh, creo que solo Eric y yo estamos. Y Josue no está participando. Josue? No, no. he's not. Okay, only both of Hello, you. Teacher. Others, no está construyendo las oraciones, ayudándole a los compañeros. Eh. Podríamos poner eh, Francisco, could you help me with me? English homework. homework. Me podrías ayudar con mi tarea de inglés. Could you help me? Oui. Uh -huh. My English. My English. Eh, sería, could you help me with the my English on home score? Home score, sí. Home score. Homework. Okay. Home homework. Home homework. Como homes, homes, como casa, homework. Home homework. Es homework. Sí. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Siguiente. <laughs> y quiero ver. Sarita que tiene muchas cosas del colegio. Sí. <risa> um, Calificar. No, eso no hago. Could you help me to Pero... save the children? ¿Podrías ayudarme a recibir a los niños? Could 
could you help me in the save? Sería, children's. Could you help me receive the children? In the save. In the save. The children. No. 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 Could okay. you help me to receive, ah, receive the children? The children. Ah, I can't yes. Please. ¿Cómo sería? Here you have it. Me? Aquí lo tienen en, en la pantalla. Could you help me to receive, receive the, the children, children, please? Remember, we always use please and the question mark at the end, a comma before the word please, okay? Uh, Could okay. you help me to receive the children, please? Okay. Y eh, eso de, de calificar, como dice Francisco, también lo podríamos agregar, Sarita. Porque sí, de pronto sí. le piden como ayuda para uh -huh. Y solo de Sarita y los demás. Eh, ya agregamos ah. de llamadas. Ya ah, de call center. De de oh, ok, great. Now Sarita is the victim. Sí, sí. Es víctima. Ok, no. great. Excelente. Llevamos cuatro. Okay. Entonces sería. Could you help me? Could you help me check the exam? Eh, le voy a poner una yo. Eh, Ajá. Mi Ajá. Eh, por lo menos puede decir: Could you help me with your. Account number. Yes. Con tu número de cuenta. With your account ah. number, coma, please, and question mark. La última. ¿Cómo es... que? Esperen. ¿Cómo, cómo? Me, me. Could you help me? Um... Okay, he said this. Could you help me with your ah, wait. account number? Number. Oh, sorry, number. But we need to add a account comment and please and question mark. Account number, please. Number, please. Could you help me with your account number, please? Account. Okay. Account. account number, please. Account. 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 Account number, please. Si no lo repito, no me olvido. También podrían poner otra que le voy a poner yo también de hoy. Could you help me with the pie slips? Mm -hmm. Pie slips. What do you mean? Uh, yeah. Could you help me? boleta de pago. Ah, pay, pay slips. Could you? Pay slips. Could you help me? Yo le puedo ir a preguntarme el dinero. Pay <laughs> slips, coma. Please, don't forget, please. Siempre, Francisco, utilizamos la palabra please porque se supone que usted está please. haciendo pedidos o requerimientos de una forma muy formal, amable y cortés. Por eso agregamos la palabra please. Si usted okay. no agrega la palabra please, no es polite request. Es una oración y está correcta, pero no es gentil, no es amable. Por eso agregamos. Entonces, ah, okay. entonces en, en todas tiene que ir, please. Obviamente, sí. Ah, Ay, qué pregunta. Y en la conversación que practicaron también, por eso están haciendo the writing practice. Okay? Ah, ok. La palabra, la, la práctica de escritura. Uh -huh. So you can recall para que recuerden. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Vaya, podemos agregar también. 
uh, could you help me in slow um, technique visit, please? Eh, ¿Podrías ayudarme a agendar una visita técnica, por favor? Uh, could you could help, you help me? me? Ajá. Could you help me, Miss Tania? Repeat, say it again. Um, Técnica. Esa palabra me cuesta pronunciarla, teacher. Se escribe. Te technical. Visit. Eh, no, no, pero le hace eh, falta el verbo. El verbo es el que le da problema. ¿Cuál es el verbo? Please. Podría ayudarme a agendar una visita técnica. Ah, agenda. Yes. Ok, ah, ¿cuál es? Could you help me book? Book. Uh, take visit. I take, I take visit, please. I take visit. Could you help me book a take visit, please? Así sería, teacher. Could you yeah. help me help book? Me book. Mm -hmm. okay. Could you help me book? And you also um, use, uh, es para agendar o para reservar también. Ah, ok. Ok. Mm -hmm. Porque I would like to book a, a room. En el hotel, yes. Me gustaría y reservar. Teacher, eh, la palabra es el ser, el ser du, eh, mi compañero. Schedule. 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 Pero, schedule. Pero fíjese que schedule es para horario más que todo. Ajá. Mm -hmm. Es que nosotros utilizamos una mucho hora. esa palabra. Ajá, trabajo. porque va, va a una hora específica. Entonces, okay. could you? No está ahí. Would you help me schedule, schedule a tech visit, coma, please? Como uh -huh. ustedes trabajan bastante con los tiempos ahí, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Falta la... Ya llevamos siete, nos faltan dos. Ok. ¿Qué significa esa palabra sketch? Sketch. Programar. Aquí. Gana. Deja el agua. <risa> Finished. Finished. Ya se echó. Ok. Yes, uh, and did you make a decision? Or... Who are going to share the sentences? The request. Yes. 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 Congratulations. Yes. You are the first group that finishes because the others are still working on that. Okay. Okay. So okay. Very well. Give me one more minute. Okay. Please. Okay, Miss. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, teacher. Hi. Uh, only you, Alexis, and Erika participated. The others didn't participate. Nosotros no participamos. Sí, Eliel, Eliel, Eliel nos ayudó. Ah, un poco. Eliel les ayudó. Ah, ok, ya puede participar Eliel. Ok, perfecto. Sí, porque la idea es que, todo, que todos practiquen, ¿verdad? Ajá, uh -huh. yes. uh -huh. that is the purpose. So you are ready, and did you make the decision? Who are going to share the sentences, the polite request in the main session room? Yes. Yes, uh, me, yo. Ah, you're going to read the sentences. Okay, great. Excellent. Eran, But, uh, eran formales, ¿verdad? Las oraciones. Yes, no ser... polite, no mm -hmm. polite request. For, for... Pedidos, pedidos Formal. formales. Okay. Could you, could you let me a book, please? Recuerden, todas deben de llevar please al final. Antes de please, insertamos una coma and the question mark at the end y el signo de interrogación al final. ¿De acuerdo? De acuerdo, teacher. Ok, great. De so, okay. May I listen to your sentences? ¿Puedo escuchar sus oraciones antes de su polite request? Antes yes. de que pasemos. Ok, please. Ok, uh, yeah. Could you organize the next meeting, please? Could you tell me how much Cole died today? Mm -hmm. 
Could you no, tell esa, me how much? Es que esa no la escuché muy bien a Erika, pero... ¿Cuál igual era Jessica, poner... Erika? Erika? Era dice, could you tell me how much calls did you do today? How much? Calls did you do today? Did you? How, how much calls? ¿De llamadas está hablando? Sí, de llamadas. Entonces sería how many, porque usted puede contar las llamadas. Recuerde ah, how much con lo que no podemos contar. Entonces haga el cambio ahí, okay. Alexis. How many, how many calls did you take today? ¿Tomaste hoy? ¿O recibiste hoy? Sí, ¿Ya? sí. ¿cuántas did llamadas? You, ok, uh, it goes like this. Alexis, how, ah, could you tell me? Could, could you, you tell me how many? Could you tell me how many uh, creo, creo calls? Que no está ¿Qué pasó aquí? <ríe> Uy. Could you tell me how many calls did you take today? Coma, please. Ya. Yeah. Ya. Yeah. And that's it. Okay, okay. Uh, the next. Okay. Uh, could you help me with this problem, please? Okay. Uh, could you show me the wall, please? Okay. Uh, we call ten plans tomorrow. No, I. Sería nosotros, ya no, ya, no, ya no podemos ocupar el please, ¿verdad? Es que en todas tienes que usar please. Ajá, pero ese, ese es como lo había escrito, es como nosotros podemos enviar, podríamos enviar los planes tomorrow, o sea, mañana. Uh, ah, pero entonces ustedes uh, están haciendo la solicitud. Ajá. Sería, could we? Could we? Could we send the... ¿Qué es lo que van a enviar? Los planes. O... The plans. Tomorrow. Please. Uh -huh. Ahí ustedes están okay. haciendo el requerimiento. A la otra persona. And probably they say, mm -hmm, ok. Yes, you can. You, 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 okay. I'm going to wait for your plans. Ok. Next one. Sería... Sí. Uh, eh, could you uh, could you help me with the plan? I don't know. You call you call you could call her tomorrow, please? No. Could you no. call her? Could you call her tomorrow, could please? Yeah. Call. Could you call her? Tomorrow, please. Could you call her tomorrow, please? Porque le está preguntando si lo podría hacer. Mm -hmm. Okay. Could you call her tomorrow, please? Next one. The next one sería. Let's see. Que ver, eh, could, you, could you come early tomorrow, please? Yes, very well. Next one. Could you call early? Uh, okay. Next. The next area. Could you call the work, please? Could you? Download. Ah, download. 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 Download the truck, please. Download. Download the what? The truck. El camión. Ah, descargar el camión. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The truck, ah. coma, please. The truck, okay. coma, please. Uh -huh. Please. Uh, the yeah. next. Uh, no, chaval, que andaba allá, ¿verdad? No. Ah. 
Ah, the, the next area, you call tie up the no, office. No, no puede poner you could, porque usted está pensando en español. Es en inglés, could you, I, al igual lo decimos en inglés, o en oh, español, Dios, Dios. podrías, ¿verdad? Comenzando con el, eh, el auxiliar, could, uh -huh. podrías, could you. Could you. Uh, could you tie up the office? Ok, very well. Could you tie up the office? Puedes limpiar o or ordenar la okay. oficina. Uh -huh. Yes, uh -huh. yes, great. Uh -huh. Solo lo único que es, recuerde que could you, porque usted le está haciendo un pedido directo a alguien, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. y, y como tiene signo de interrogación, tiene que iniciar con una palabra que le habilita formular una pregunta. No puede decir you could. Tú podrías. No, podrías tú, ¿ok? Ok, entonces sería Could you bring me a cup of coffee, please? That's ok. That's it. Ok, teacher. Those are the questions. Ok, excellent. Very well. Let's class. return. Let's get back. And eh? now you are ready to represent your group. Great. Okay. Class, uh, let's listen to group number one, Francisco, eh, Coreas, Sarita, and Tania. Okay. Okay. I am Big TV. <laughs> um, number one. Could you help me write the report, please? Okay. Number two. Could you help me answer the call, please? Number three. Could you help me my English homework, please? Number four. Could you help me to receive the children's, please? Number five. Could you help me write your account number please number six could you help me with the pay slips please number seven could you help me book a tech visit please number eight could you help me expose the activity please number nine could you help me make some copies please number ten could you help me with 10 on homework, please? Homework, please. Okay, very well. There is one sentence in which you need to add with my English, with my English homework, I think, yeah? You need to add the word with, with my English homework, yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. excellent for the rest. Congratulations, very well done, group. And thank you, Sarita, for being very brave, for ser muy valiente y sharing, uh, to share 
for sharing your work with the class. And now... Thank you. Okay, great. The idea is to practice as much as possible. Remember, practice makes perfect. Now, uh, here we go. Pablo, Sochil, Fatima. The presenters are... Okay, please. Okay. Number one, uh, could you send the mail to new client, please? Number two, could you come early, please? Number three, could you come on Wednesday with S4, please? Number four, could you come on an hour early, please? Number five, could you share your number, please? Number, number six, could you organize a meeting with the new employees, please? Number seven, could you write this report, please? Number eight, could you help me with this report, please? Number nine, could you potential client, please? Number 10, could you help me with the computer, please? Number 11, could you help me with my homework, please? Finish it, Great, thank you. Congrats, very well done your work. Now we have Alexis, Eliel, and Erica in group number three. Okay, teacher. Please. Okay, uh, number one, could you bring me a cup of coffee, please? Would you call her tomorrow, please? Could you send the plans tomorrow, please? Could you tie up the office, please? Uh, could you down out the truck, please? Could you come early tomorrow, please? And could you make a work report, please? Uh, could you show me the well, please? Could you help me with this problem, please? And finish, and could you tell me how many calls did you take today, please? And that's it. Excellent. Great. Very well done. Don't forget, class, you need to write a comma before the word please and the question mark because it is a request, es un pedido, es una solicitud que ustedes están haciendo. Es como una pregunta de una forma muy amable, ¿verdad? Now, let's continue and here we go. Okay. This is what you were doing, right? You were writing 10 formal requests using could. Now, let's move to the next slide. Here, introduction to the, uy, introduction to the topic. Working in small groups, okay? I'm going to transfer you again to the breakout rooms. You are going to classify the request in formal or informal. Van a clasificar las, los requerimientos en formales o informales. You analyze the sentence and you write if it is formal or informal. And in order to do that, you have here, okay, uh, there's uh, 12 sentences and you have formal or informal. I'm going to share this slide with you and then you decide if the sentence is formal or informal. Is that okay? Here, let me see, over okay. here. Right now, here, here, so sharing. Yes. Okay. There you are. Now let's go to the breakout rooms. Everybody participating, okay? Remember, practice makes pra uh, perfect. Go to your groups, please. And begin classifying those uh, requests. 
either formal or informal. Oscar, do you remember your partners? Oscar, recuerda a sus compañeros. No, you don't. Oscar. Eh, estaba con eh, Tania. Ok. Hold it. In group number one. Yes, yeah, teacher. Ok, I sent you the invitation. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, okay. Tulio, you go to group number three, Tulio. Eh, ahí en el en el chat ella compartió unas oraciones. Entonces las vamos, las vamos a, ¿cómo se llama? Vamos a ver cuál es la formal y la informal. Ya, me, me entendieron. <risa> Hola. Ah, ya, ya me entendí. Me escucharon, ¿no? Yo sí. No, yo pienso que, que se me va el audio, pienso cuando no me contesta. <risa> Vale. Yo lo voy a traspasar todo al cuaderno. Ay, Dios mío. Para ir haciendo. No. Entonces, la primera sí, porque dice que yo stand up, please. Es correcta. Pero aquí creo que hay que pasarla por obligación. Mm. Correct. Un one, correct. Second, también la segunda. Can you let me? Me está pidiendo, por favor. Um, no, la uno creo que tendría que ser podrías. No. Sí, la uno no. No, pues podrías poner. Y la segunda. Para... Podrías repetir esto. Podría. Uh, podrías repetir esto. Y la no, tercera sí es... dice podrías. No, no, pero aquí la dos está malo porque tendría que ser Ken. Eso es la tres. La tres, could you let me cinco. Podrías, creo que es prestarme, vea, cinco dólares. Sí, eso está bien. Con you spell you let's name. Podrías leer. No, aquí de la cuatro letrar. sería. Puedes deletrear tu nombre. Can you spell you let's Está bien. Segura. Can you give me a piece of paper? Puedes darme un pedazo de papel, por favor. ¿Dónde dice pedazo? A piece. Ah, pero okay. aquí solo dice pedazo, pedazo de papel. <ríe> ¿Cómo dice? Podría, solo dice Can you get me? Eh, y creo que está mal también. 
La, ¿Por dónde van? ¿Por la tercera? Podría. Por la cinco. ¿Qué, qué en yuki? Darme un pedazo. Darme un pedazo de papel. Dice, ¿Puedes sí. darme un papel, por favor? No, uh -huh. Como no. dice Ape, un pedazo. No, please. <ríe> qué chistos. Un eh. papel, por favor. Can you move your chain? Yo voy a decir algo bien chido que... Espérame, mamá. Ok, eh, las seis sería... Podríamos ver... Y ahora vamos a practicar las preguntas o vamos a confirmar los estatus. Eso lo era clasificar, según entendí yo. Ok. Entonces, finish. Uh -huh. Finish. Así de forma rápida, uno informal, dos formal, tres formal, cuatro informal, cinco informal, seis formal, siete informal, ocho informal, nueve formal, diez informal, once informal y doce formal. Yes. Sí, ¿verdad? Yes. yes. Ok. Todos estamos igual. Ahí okay, estamos. Ok, great. Are, are ready? Now you are ready to, and you know how to classify and identify formal and informal request. Yes? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, Excellent. Very well. Okay, give me one second. I'm going to monitor the last group and then we'll return, okay? Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Hello, class. Did you finish? Did you finish the classification? Yes. Yes. Okay, so we can return. Ya terminaron la clasificación, ¿verdad? Ahora ya podemos retornar, ¿sí? Ok, teacher. Ok, let's get back. Thank you. Let's wait for the other partners, okay? In seven, five seconds, they will be back. Great. Now, class, here we go. In team number three, we have Alexis, Eliel, Erika, and Fanny. So, would you share what you have? Group? Okay. Tell me, in your opinion, uh, in our opinion, mm -hmm. the first is informal. Okay, very well. Okay, uh, the second is formal formal great i'm going to yes. ask okay excellent thank you now class for all of you i ask you number three is it a formal or informal request this is formal, formal request. Num number number three could you lend me $5, please? Is it formal or informal? 
There is formal. It is formal because we are using the modal auxiliary could. Okay. Yes. That's correct. Okay. Now number four. Can you spell your name, your last name? Formal informal. or informal? Informal. 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 And, it, and even so, it doesn't have the word the word uh, please, right? So it is with more emphasis that it is informal. Now number five. Can you give me a piece of paper, please? Informal. 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 Number six. Could you move uh, your chair, please? Formal. 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 Maybe in a meeting, right? In a reunion. Number six. Yeah. Uh, sorry, seven. Can you open the door, please? Informal. Informal. Can you turn on the lights? Informal. Informal. Number nine, could you change the ink cartridge, please? Formal. formal. Number nine is formal. Could you change the ink cartridge, please? It's formal because we're using could, the modal auxiliary yeah. could. Number 10, <laughs> can you install the antivirus in my PC, please? Informal. 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 Wow. Number 11, can you buy a package of paper? Informal. Informal. 12. Could you order the snacks for the meeting, please? Formal. formal. It is formal, yeah. Okay, very well. Now you are able to classify the sentences either in formal or informal. Okay, very well. The request, polite request, or now let's go over page 44 in your manual, please. Where is that? Over here. Mm -hmm. the, yeah, this is 44. You are going to have a reading comprehension activity class. Read about printer qualities and answer the questions below. Color. Color is important for users who need to print pages for presentations or maps and other pages where color is part of the information. Color printers can also be set to print only in black and white. Color printers are more expensive to operate since they use two cartridges two cartridges, one color and one black ink that need to be replaced after a certain number of pages. Users who don't have specific need for color and who print a lot of pages will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Resolution. Printer resolution, the sharpness of text and images on papers is usually measured in dots per inch DPI, dots per inch DPI. Most inexpensive printers provide sufficient Resolution for most purposes at 600 DPI. Speed. If you do much printing, the speed of the printer becomes important. Inexpensive printers print only about three to six sheets per minute. Color printing is slower. More expensive printers are much faster. Memory, memory, not memory, no. Memory, memory, you don't pronounce the O, memory. Most printers come with a small amount of memory. For example, one megabyte that can be expanded by the user having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful 
and faster when printing out pages with large images or tables with lines around them, which the printer treats as a large image. So these are the characteristics of printers that we're going to be uh, working with right now. Mm, I would like to have one volunteer to read about color. Who wants to help me reading about color? Yeah. Me, teacher. Okay, mm -hmm. Miss, go ahead, please. Color is important for a user who, oh, who needs see. to print page see, no. for presentation okay. or maps mm -hmm. and other okay. page where color is part of yeah. the information. Color printers ca can also yeah. be set to print only in black and, black and white. Color printers mm -hmm. are more expensive to operate since they use to in cartridges. Car cartridges. Mm -hmm. One color and one black ink that need to be replaced after a certain number of pages. User who user who don't have a specific need for color and who print a lot of page will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Thank you so much. Great. The only thing is that to operate since, okay, since, the proposition since. since, yes. Okay. Thank you. Somebody else who helped me reading about resolution? Who is going to read the paragraph about resolution in the printers? Thank you, Alexis. Please be my guest. Okay, resolution. Printer resolution, the sharpness of text and images on paper is usually measured in dots per inch DPA. Most inexpensive printers provide, super provide sufficient resolution for most purposes at 600 DPA. Okay, DPI. I, DPI. DPI. Sorry, okay, I. DPI. Thank you. Now, speed. Who is going to help us reading speed class? Another participant? Another volunteer, please? Hello? I don't have volunteers to read about speed. Hey. Okay, Eliel, thank you so much. Speed. <laughs> okay, speed. If you do much printing, the speed of the printer becomes important. Uh, inexpensive is? Yes? Yes, yes. Okay. Inexpensive printers print only about three to six sheets. Per, per minute. Per minute. Minutes. Minutes. Mm -hmm. Color printing is slower. More expensive printers are much faster. Thank you. What about memory? Memory. Who is going to help me read in memory? Another participant? You have to read. Do I have a student? Only for only three students. Let me see. <gasps> I know. Okay, I'm going to read the last paragraph, and Pablo, you are going to read when I finish. Okay. Don't be afraid. Yes, teacher. It's better to to misread a word here. De leer mal una palabra acá, porque ya cuando se van a los breakouts, ya no los puedo corregir a todos a la vez, ¿verdad? Okay, memory, memory, you don't pronounce O. Memory, memory, memory. no, memory, no. Memory, memory. Most memory. printers, 
Usually we don't pronounce T when it is before N. Usualmente no pronunciamos la T cuando va antes una letra N. Printers, like internet, important, ¿ya? Most printers come with a small amount of memory. For example, one megabyte that can be expanded by the user. Having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printing out pages with large images or tables. Tables son los, los cuadros, ¿verdad? Con, con datos. With lines around them which the printer treats as a large image. Okay, try now, Pablo, try. Memory, most printer come with a small amount of memory for example, one megabyte that can be expand, expanded by the user. Even more that the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printed out page with large image or table or table with line around then with the printer treats a large image. 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 Okay, in much, in very much. well. So I'm going to read it one more time, class. Please listen. Color. Color is important for users who need to print pages for presentations or maps and other pages where color is part of the information. Color printers. You say, and I say color printers, can also be set to print only in black and white. Color printers are more expensive to operate since they use two cartridges, one color and one color and one black ink that need to be replaced after a certain number of pages. Users who don't have a specific need for color and who print a lot of pages will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Resolution. Printer, printer, okay, resolution, printer resolution, the sharpness, la nitidez, the sharpness of text and images of paper is usually measured in dots per inch. Most inexpensive printers provide sufficient resolution for most purposes at 600 DPI, DPI, I. Speed. If you do much printing, the speed of the printer becomes important. Inexpensive printers print only about three to six sheets per minute. Per minute. Color printer is slower. More expensive printers are much faster. Memory. Most printers come with a small amount of memory. For example, one megabyte that can be expanded by the user having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printing out pages with large images or tables with lines around them which the printer treats as large image. So class, what you are going to do in the breakout rooms is this. You read, all of you have to read the four paragraphs because these are the characteristics or features of the printer. Read about printer qualities and answer the questions below. The ones you have five questions that you need to answer based on the reading about the printer qualities. Is that okay? But before we go 
to the breakout rooms and this is at page 44 class. I'm going to call your names in order to take your second attendance because it's going to take a long time and it is almost time. So Brandon Alexis. Present. Thank you. Cecilia absent today. Daniel absent. Diana. Diana, at the beginning, she was a couple of minutes. Now she's absent. Erika? Present, Miss. Thank you, Miss Erika. Fanny? Present, teacher. Thank you, Miss Fanny. Fatima? Present, teacher. Thank you, Miss Fatima. Francisco Correa Jimenez? Present, Miss. Great. Uh, Jocelyn? Jocelyn. Francisco Ernesto González. Present, Miss. Thank you, Francisco. Eliel. Eliel Jonathan. Eliel Jonathan. Present. Thank you. Mm, Josué. Josué. Okay, thank you. Jose Francisco Salguero, he's here. Francisco Mejia. Are you are you there? Mr. Francisco Mejia? No, he isn't. Okay. Luis absent, Mayra absent. Oscar? Present teacher. Thank you, sir. Pablo, always here. Present teacher. Pablo, you were always here. You never missed a class a hundred percent of the of the attendance. Wow. Sarita, are you there? Sarita. Yes, I am here. Okay. <laughs> Doing the homework. Eh, Sarita, thank you. Tania? Present teacher. Thank you, Miss Tania. Teresa de Jesus. Teresa. Present. Thank you. Sochil. Present teacher. Thank you. Tulio. Tulio. Tulio is a listener right now. Exactly the time. Okay, class. Two activities you have to uh, develop, develop, desarrollar, okay, in the breakout rooms. You get ready with uh, the reading at page 44. You take turns and read, okay, the four paragraphs. Deben turnarse. Todos deben de participar en la lectura, ¿verdad? Pueden hacer varias rondas si quieren. La primera vez, eh, digamos, Teresa, no, porque ella, está, ella no participa. Eh, Pablo lee el primer párrafo. Alexis el segundo. Sarita el tercero. Y Eliel el cuarto. En la segunda ocasión que van a leer, entonces ya cambian de, de posición, ¿verdad? Digamos, el y el acá y así van, para que todos tengan la oportunidad de practicar leyendo el vocabulario y darle la entonación a las, a las oraciones. Cuando han terminado de leer, contestan estas preguntas considerando la información que tienen en este artículo. ¿Está ok? Ok, okay. here we go. Reading practice, reading and reading and comprehension. Go to your groups. Oscar, I sent you the invitation. Please join. Oscar, le envié la invitación. Go to your groups. 
Tania, Eliel, go to your group. Fatima, Oscar, Tulio, go to your groups before your classmates are waiting for you. You need to participate eight actively. Where is, ah, okay, here. Go to your group, Josue. I sent you to your group. Josue is that your group is number three. Join your group, please. Use in card, 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 cartridges, cartridges. Cartridge. I, I Cartridge. Mean, Cartridge. Oh, yes. oh my God. Uh -huh. yes. Your conscience, yes. la conciencia no. de la mispronunciation, de la pronunciación. Okay. No. Cartridges. Cartridges. Cartridges, one color and one black ink that need to be replaced after a certain number of pays. Users who don't have a specific nail for color and who print a lot of paste will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Vaya Francisco. Resolution. Printer resolution. The sharpness of text and Imagine on paper is usually most of in that measured, measured, measured in dots per inch. Me tengo que aprender el abecedario en inglés. DPI, DPI, again. DPI, DPI. Most inexpensive, 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 inexpensive price provided, 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 provided sufficient resolution for most for for full post uh, multi purpose multi purpose. <laughs> Purpose. <laughs> uh, hey, 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 listen, listen, Francisco. Uh, uh, um, yesterday you were absent. And I think yes. that now you feel like a little bit lost, yeah? Because you are yeah. always in class. See? Um, I suggest you something. Le sugiero algo. Uh -huh. ¿Cree usted que al final de la clase se puede quedar conmigo 10 minutos para que repasemos lo de ayer y lo de ahora? Pide, Miss, que no le voy a mentir. Estoy haciendo planilla aquí en la casa. Así es que Estamos usted dijo que el, trabaja el, también en casa. Ah, ok, perfecto. Entonces, estamos, es mañana que, puede es, ser. Okay. Como mañana pagamos y tenemos varios proyectos trabajando. Mm, Son yeah. como. Oh my God, oh my God. Son como 7 mil personas es... ahorita. If the money is not ready, oh my God, I don't uh, want yeah. to be in your shoes. Si el dinero no está listo, los cheques, no quiero estar en sus zapatos. Ok, <laughs> entonces tal vez mañana para que se ponga al tanto de lo que, ok. Thanks, Miss. Ok, thank you. Continue, pero traten de eh, recordar la pronunciación de las palabritas, ¿verdad? Y de la entonación, por favor, ok. Ok, continue. Yeah, pues, Acaba yeah. practicar también Tania, ¿verdad? ¿O no? Tania, no, yes, sí. Ah, ok, great, excellent. Continue. Eh, most purple at... ¿Cómo se le diría? 600. Ah, you see? 600, 600. 600. Um... ¿Cuál me toca tú? Resolution. Resolution. De nuevo. Okay. 
Ah, for, ya, ya, ya. Inter, el, for inter resolution, the sharp, sharpness of text and im, image on paper is usually measured in dots per inch. Most inexpensive printers provide sufficient, 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 sufficient resolution for most or purposes, 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 purposes at six hundred, six hundred DPI, DPI. Okay. Okay, Pablo. The speed. If you the mouse printing, the speed of the printer becomes important. In expensive printer prints, only about three to six sets for per minute. Color printing is lower. More expensive printers are much faster. Okay. But Memory. Most printer come with a small amount of memory, for example, one megabyte. That can be expanded by the user having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printer or page with large image or tables with lines around them which the printer three treats as a large image. Okay, finish. Vaya, okay. Ahora, ¿quién, ¿Quién va a iniciar? Eh, inicia. eh, um, um, color. Fátima, ¿verdad? Okay. okay, may I have uh, 10 seconds here? Puedo tener 10 segundos acá. Uh, Miss Fátima, ¿será posible que hoy va a tener la sesión one on one? Yes, teacher. Ok, thank you. Sí, porque mañana terminamos, ¿verdad? Ok. <risa> Now, miren, tienen que ir viendo las palabritas así con cuidadito, ¿verdad? No traten de leer demasiado rápido porque aquí sí hay unas palabritas que son un poquito técnicas y nos tienden a confundir y pronunciamos mal, ¿de acuerdo? Entonces háganlo con calma, ¿sí? Una yes. consulta, repetir, este, car, cartridge, eh, cartridges, la la... ok, singular es cartridge, cartucho, cartridge, pero acá como es plural, cartridges, 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 cartridges. la fuerza de voz va al principio, el stress, ¿verdad? Le llamamos en inglés, pero es la fuerza de voz, en la primera sílaba, cartridges, 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 ok, ok, continue, ok, Um, ahora invertimos, eh, como Fátima ya leyó varias veces, Resolution. Puedes iniciar, Color. después okay. te sigue Francisco, después te sigo yo y por último Pablo. Ok. Ok. Color is important for users who, who need to print this page for presentation or maps and other page. Where color is part of the information, color printers can also be set to print only in black, black and white. Color printers are more expensive to operate since they use to in cartouches, one color and one black ink that need to be replaced after a certain number of pages. users who, who don't have a specific need for color and who print a lot of a lot of pages will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate The solution, printer, the solution. The sniper, no, the chirpen, the chirnet of text and image of pen. Okay. 
Te lo respetamos. Ok, let me see. That's Josué was asking. Me too. Lo um, ok, here. Um, eh, leyeron um, ya todos los párrafos. Ah, es que aquí es poca la gente que, que está activa, yes. ¿verdad? Solamente um, Erika en you. Y ya leyeron sí, todos y, los párrafos. Sí, sí, estuvo. Y Elia el que repasó una vez. Ah, perdió la conexión. Sí, porque mm. no lo veo acá. Quiero ver. Sí, Al está Eliel, aquí, pero... y, don, y bueno, y Eliel, ¿qué le pasa? Que está, ok. Eh, ok, pero ya sí, ya, ya, ya practicó Eliel. ¿Sí? Yes. Once, una vez. Ok, at least once. Eh, ya contestaron sí, 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 las sí. preguntas. Ya contestaron sí, las preguntas. Oh, eh, ahorita con... estamos en el... Ah, vaya, ok, perfecto. Excellent. Great. Ok, teacher. Ok, continue. Ok, Erika, para ti. Hola. La pregunta número uno. Eh, sería black and white. Digo yo. Ajá, los pero que, que usa, los colores que más usan creo que son esos. Pero dice por qué es el color H. Ajá, no, ¿cuál, cuál, por qué? Because, um, can I... Why yeah, because is color important for some users? Because they need to print page for presentation or maps and other page where color is part of the information. La primera fila de color, eh? Ajá. Ajá, no color is important. Ahí dice, color is important for user who need to sex get per ¿Cómo se dice minuto? Minute. Minute. Color printing is No, minutes. 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 Color printing is is lower more expensive reading are much faster faster or faster faster in memory a most prettier home white and small amount of memory uh, for example one megabit that can be ex expect by the user. Maybe more than the menu, menu amount of memory is helpful and faster with printing out pages with layer ima imagined or tablet. 
which link around the which the printer pre as large im image. 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 Okay, now answer the questions. Okay, teacher. With this color important for some usuary. ¿Por qué no colores? DPI. Number two. Number three. El de los colores más caros, el de color. Ahí dice. Okay, dice. Y... Why are color printers more expensive? ¿Por qué el color, por qué la impresión de color? Es más cara. Ajá, es más cara. A ver. Dice. Aquí dice en el, el color, dice color printers are more expensive to operate, operate. Mm -hmm. since they es are too in car cartridge. Car cartridge. Sí, sí. Cartridges. Cartridges. Ah, gracias, mi, gracias. Mm -hmm. Cartridges. Gracias, mi. Es que esa palabra me confunde. Mm -hmm. Me como las letras. Pero esa cantar. es. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Entonces, eh, porque, ajá, sería color primero, are more expensive to operate. Yes. Uh -huh. Hasta ahí. Color printers are uh, more expensive. And the color cartridges, the color cartridges are more expensive. Los cartuchos de color son más caros. Ok. Repeat, Miss, please. <laughs> you have it here. <laughs> uh, which is the, the question? Color. Uh, number three. Okay, read Cartridge. the question because I don't, I don't see the question here. Porque como ustedes uh, están partiendo, no, no veo la pregunta. Léamela ahí. Okay. Why are color printers uh -huh. more expensive? Ah, because, ok, regresen a la, al color. Acá lo tienen, mire. Um, yes. User who don't have a specific need of a color who print a lot of pages will find, ok. Color printers can also be set to print only one, uh, are more expensive. Acá lo tienen. Color printers are more expensive to operate. Are more expensive to operate. Color printers are more expensive to operate. Okay. In number four. Question number four. Es que, están, es que están en la página cuarenta y cinco. No lo bajen mucho. Bájenlo suavemente para que se ubiquen en las preguntas. Ok. Number five. What is the amount of memory that most printers come with? ¿Con cuánta memoria viene la mayoría de impresoras? En esa época, ¿verdad? Que hicieron el libro. <laughs> According to the reading, yeah, because every year. Creo que traía un megabyte. Ahí está. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Ah, you have it in here, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. One megabyte. Okay, it's time to get back to the main session room. Yes? And we ah, no, start... Ah, no, 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 no
Uh, what is something important for someone who prints a lot? Algo importante para alguien que imprime mucho, ¿qué será? La memoria. No. La memoria. No. no. Más arriba dice. En el, en el, en el, ajá. Here. If you do much printing in speed, if you, en la yes. eh, velocidad, if you do much printing, the speed of the printer becomes important. The speed of the printer becomes important. Uh -huh. La velocidad de la impresora es importante. Sí. Ajá. So you say the speed of the printer becomes, no. Ajá. The, the speed of the printer becomes important. And that's it. Yes. 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 Excellent. Very well. Thank you, Miss. Okay, let's return. Thank you for help us. Okay, my pleasure. Let's return. Okay, let's wait 20 seconds while the others get back. And then we're going to share the answers to standardize that we have the same answers, okay? All of us. Mm Okay, here we go. Let's see the answers. Question number one, why is color important for some users? The answer is, why is color important for some users? Uh, the print page for present or maps no. les voy a suplicar que no me intervengan la pantalla porque miren aquí se queda cortada la idea verdad entonces color is important for users who need to print pages print, print. For, for presentations, present, uh, or in that case, but it is not only for presentations or maps. Color is important for users who need to print, okay? You have to say all and other pages where color is part of the information hasta acá, okay? Tendría que ser la respuesta. And then we have, for number two, what does DPI stand for? What is the meaning of DPI? The meaning for DPI is here DPI you, dot per int. That's per, per int. int. Well. Why are color printers more expensive? Uh, more expensive. But why? Por qué son más caras? More expensive, printing are uh, much faster. Oh, father, come on. Okay. So, my velocity. Printers are more expensive to operate. Porque son más caras para trabajar, ¿verdad? Color printers are more expensive to operate. That is the answer. Then, number four, what is something important for some one who prints a lot. ¿Qué es algo importante? ¿Cuál detalle es importante para alguien que imprime mucho, hace muchas impresiones? Speed, la velocidad. Speed, mm -hmm. ¿ya? Speed is important. If you do much printing, the speed of the printer becomes important. So the speed is important. 
And the last one, what is the amount of memory that most printers come with? La memoria con la que la mayoría de las impresoras vienen. ¿Cuál es? Here, one megabyte. Yes, here. One megabyte. One megabyte. Okay. And that's it. This is the answer for number five. What is the amount of memory that most, la mayoría, printers come with? One megabyte. And that's it. Okay, class. Thank you so much. You did a great job. Remember, tomorrow we have the last class. Mañana tenemos la última clase. Eh, Josué, necesito que me termine esa plataforma, por favor. Okay. Um, tomorrow we're going to complete the, the survey. Vamos a completar la, la encuesta. Y acá me van a compartir. Acá se tiene que hacer la encuesta en clase, ¿verdad? No antes ni después. En clase. Y me van a compartir una screenshot en el momento que la van a realizar. Ok, so thank you very much. Hope to see you tomorrow. Sleep tight and enjoy your relaxing and fresh night. Only Miss Fatima stays bueno. with the teacher. Bye bye. Take care. Good night. ¿Cuál encuesta, Miss? Good Miss? night. Ahí se las mandaron por correo. Lo de ahora ya la hice. No tiene que hacerla antes porque yo. tiene que mandarme una screenshot. Y Ahí yo la hice y ya me cerró. El correo dice que tiene que hacerla una sola vez. Soy a WhatsApp me la clase. mandaron. Sí, pero ahí dice que tiene que hacerla en la clase, ¿verdad? Soy, porque no necesita, dije. ah, pues hable con la administración, porque yo ellos le van, a pedir, le van a pedir una screenshot y le van a decir si la puede hacer otra vez, ¿ok? Ok. De acuerdo. Ok, have a good night, bye bye, take care. Bye, good miss. night. Uh, relax. Yeah. Only Miss Fatima. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye, Francisco. Bye bye, Josué. Bye bye, Eliel. Ok, Miss Fatima, here. It is the time for you to be the star. Yes, teacher. Bye, Miss Fátima. Fíjese que un detallito que me estaba fijando es que usted no me pronuncia los plurales. Por ejemplo, en page, pages, tiene que ser acá. Color is important for users who need to print pages. 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 Se me lo dice en singular. Para los plurales okay. tenemos que hacer una fuercecita más de voz. Pages. Okay. Igual acá. Cartridges. Cartridges. Okay. Cartridges. 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 Ok, vaya, comience a leerme. Vamos a practicar lectura. Ok. Color is important for users who need to print pages for presentation or maps and other pages. No, pages. Where color? No, pages. Other pages. Other pages where color is part of the information. Color printers can also be set to print only in black and white. Color printers are more expensive to operate since they used to in cartridges one color and one black ink that need to be re replaced after a certain number of pages. Users who don't have a specific need for color and who print a lot of pages will find a black and white printer cheaper to operate. Excellent. Now you did it better. Ya ve, lo hace mejor cuando pronuncia completita la palabra en plural. Now resolution. Okay. Resolution. Printers. Resolution. The sharp, sharpness. 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 Sharp, sharpness of text. An image of paper is no. usually. Images. 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 Images on paper is usually meant 
make sure no make sure make sure in that per inch uh, dpi dpi <laughs> dpi most inexpensive printers provide sufficient 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 sufficient, sufficient, sufficient resolution for most por <laughs> purposes por purposes purposes at 600 dpi okay excellent speed okay. Sp speed if you do much printing the speed of the printer becomes important inexpensive printers print only about three to six sheets per minute color printing is slower more expensive printers are much much faster memory memory most printers come with a small amount of memory for example one megabyte that can be exp expanded. Expand expanded by the user having more than the minimum amount of memory is helpful and faster when printing out pages with large Im image images or tables images or tables with lines around them which the printer treats, treats, treats. as treats as a large image, image. images image. image now read the questions why is color important for some users? Mm -hmm. Continue with the questions. What does DPI stand for? Why are color printers more expensive? What is something important for someone who printers? Prints. Perdón. Who prints mm -hmm. a lot? What is amount of memory that most printer come with? Excellent. So you see, it is a good practice to read. And now, here, I need you to read this conversation for me, please. Okay, teacher. Mike Hernandez, IT department. You read Hello, the complete... Mike. Okay. Hello, Mike. Mm -hmm. This is Maria Ochoa from Accounting. I would like to report a problem with my printer. What is the problem, Mr. Ochoa? Mrs. It doesn't seem to be working and it's making a strange noise. Is there a message in the control panel? Yes, it is. Says service. Also, there is a red light on the euro bottom. I would like you to come soon to check it. I see. I'll I'll be there right away. Very well. Good. Congrats. Now. Okay, go over this conversation between Peter and Robert, please. Okay. Good morning. This is Peter from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Peter. This is Robert. I'm calling from the Human Resource Department. I like to report a problem with my computer. What is? What is it, Robert? It doesn't seem to work. I see. Let me ask you some questions. Okay. Repeat after me. Human resources. 
human resources. Mm. It doesn't seem to work. It doesn't seem to work. Very well. Only that. And here, okay. I am ever and you are Beth. Hi, Beth. Long time no see. How are you? Hello, Ever. What are you doing these days? I am okay. Well, I am working on a new project. And also, I am taking an English course these days. How about you? That sounds great. What, co what a coincidence. I'm also taking an English course. English is essential at the workplace these days. I know a colleague who completed the course is taking a training in England these days. You are right. I am studying on my own. You know, I am reading novels to have better results. Great. Well, I am doing listening exercises. They help a lot. Now we switch. You are ever and I am best. Okay. Hi, Beth. Long time no see. How are you? Hello, Ever. What are you doing these days? I'm okay. Well, I'm working on a new project and also I'm taking an English course this day. These days. How, how about you? Uh, that sounds great. What a coincidence. I am also taking an English course. English is essential these days. I know a colleague, a colleague, colleague, colleague who compared the course is taking a training England this day. You are right. I am studying on my own. You know, I am reading novels to have better results. Great. Well, I'm doing listening exercise. They help a lot. Very well. Excellent. Now here, there's another conversation okay, between Rita and Luis. Uh, you are Rita and I am Luis, okay? Okay, teacher. You begin. You are Rita. Okay. Luis, good afternoon. This is Rita, the new secretary. The new secretary. I just want to confirm some informi information. Hey, Rita, sure. Tell me. I want to know who are attending the annual conference this year and where is he? Is it taking place? Well, the IT staff is attending and the conference is taking place in the great room. Uh, Rita, by the way, when are the materials arriving? Do you know? Go, oh, it is, yes. Uh, they are arriving on Friday morning. Now, I am Rita and you, Luis. Luis, Luis, good afternoon. This is Rita, the new secretary. I just want to confirm some information. Hey, Rita, sure, tell me. I want to know who are attending the annual conference this year and where is it taking place? Well, the IT staff is attending and the conference is taking place in the great room. Rita, by the way, when are the materials arriving? Do you know? Got it. Yes, they are arriving on Friday morning. Okay, Miss Fatima, thank you so much for giving me these minutes after class. Uh, you finished your platform long time ago. Okay, uh, sleep very well. Enjoy this relaxing time. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye. Have a good bye -bye, night. Bye-bye, teacher. Thank you. My pleasure. Bye-bye.